All right, so we got to check here. Oh, yes, he's checking me in the past. So me blocking here does not solve the problem because the queen can come back in the past. Even if this king moves... Is this, is this checkmate? Have I lost? I haven't lost. It would tell me if I lost. Now, interestingly, this I found this funny. Um, I'm going to set this game capture. I'm going to reset transform. Every other game, I have to make it bigger for the stream. That's that's not an issue. But this is the only game that I've had this. So I'm going to reset the transformation. This is what it gives me. I don't know why the game doesn't look like this. But for some reason, when I try to capture it, it goes upside down and backwards. So this is 5D chess. Uh, we will start out with a few puzzles, just so everybody gets the idea of what we're doing. So we are white, and we have to mate king in one. Now. It shows you the timeline here, and you can get some cool visualizations. So this shows you everywhere the rook can go. So the rook can move in one direction as far as it wants. That includes uh, vertically, horizontally, or backwards through time. It could also move through the present uh, games, and we'll get into that more. But right now, there's only one dimension, or there's one timeline, and we are at the present. So we have to play the present. Now we have got to mate the king in one. How do we do that? If we, you know... Try moving it here. The king's just going to submit the move. The king can just move out of the way. We didn't solve the puzzle. So what instead we need to do, since the rook can go through any dimension as far as it wants, through one dimension at a time, we can bring the rook up here. King can't get to the rook. We submit this move. How is this checkmate? Because the king can't do anything to stop it, and I can go back in time and mate a king in the past. You can't save a king in the past unless you take out the piece that's taking out the king in the past, which is a very interesting idea. Let's do another uh, rook tactics, mate in two. So you could try the old this, which you do in normal chess, right? Mate in two, submit the moves. So the king goes back in time and creates a new timeline. So the rule is you can, you have to play all the boards in the present. So anything in white I can play on, I must play on all boards labeled white that have a purple arrow through them. I'll get what that means in a second, but just know I have to play this board and I'm free to play this board if I so choose. Wait, why won't this work? Oh, because I know why that won't work, because that's not the present. This happens in the future, so I have to wait to get there and that would be under two moves. So can I do it? Yes, yeah, so if I move this rook here, even if this king captures, well, the king can't capture. The king is pinned, because if this king moves out of this uh, column, this rook can take this king, I think. Yes. The king can't put the other king in check, and so the king is stuck. Okay, so I'm white, and I've created another timeline. So I'll just show you here. So it's my turn, and let's say I want to... Oh, I can't do anything there. Let's say I have the king move here, just just for just to show you what happens. So the king moves. So now you see this line is white. I've created too many timelines. Black does not have to play this until black creates a new timeline. So you can always have one more timeline than your opponent. After that, these are considered not functional until black creates enough timelines to come back here. So you can't keep making new timelines to save yourself. You are limited to one more than your opponent. So we'll uh, reset the puzzle because that clearly was not the right thing to do. So I need to have a mate in, what is it, mate in one. Moving, so moving here, so if I were to do this, let's say, I don't think this creates a new timeline. Oh no, it does because that, that wasn't an active board. So I can either do it here and I don't think it's here because all I have is, is a king there. Moving here, I think? Let's try it. No, I don't think that will work because the king can just take it, but let's see. Submit moves. Oh, but they... Wait, hold on. Undo move. So it's Black's turn to play... Oh, it's Black's turn to play this board, not this board. This board's already happened. You can't change the past 
you can only you can only play on active board. So that's why this king can't jump here. And so I have mated the king here because nothing they can do on this board, the active board, stops my rook from taking their king. All right, so now we are black. We have to do a mate in one. What about moving back? Let's just... Because if they move here, king can just go here. So that will create a new timeline. It moves the present backwards. I'm just going to say it. This game has too many dimensions. It has all of the dimensions. Uh, but I don't think that's... Let's just see. No. The, I was right, and the king was able to just get out by moving closer. Okay, so we'll reset the puzzle. Oh, wait a second. If I go here, and then I protect it here... Puzzle complete. Okay, how is the puzzle complete? Okay, because this rook can move back in time. And this rook is protecting this rook from being captured by either king. See, because this rook could move through the dimensions to take a king on this space. Let's do a queen tactics. Mate in one, because the queen is another interesting uh, character. She can move in any dimension and as many dimensions as she wants as long as she moves the same amount through each dimension. So this queen uh, could move mate in one. I don't think this will work. Wait, but this would work. Would this work? Right, because she could move. So she moves back in time one to here. And then, so she's moving uh, vertically, horizontally, and through time one. And then she's moving one vertically, one horizontally, and one through time two. Uh, mating this king. We're going to do a CPU match. We'll have random color. We'll do start with trainer weak, and then we'll do a, let's do a small. Start with a small and play. So this is a regular chess match. So they're white. They move first. Okay. Okay. Uh, so here's our kings. Our kings are kind of, this allows me to develop my queen. I like that. This might be the move. I'm going to, I'm going to, it's, it's either this pawn or this pawn. And I'm liking this pawn more because I can develop my queen from there. Bishop's still sort of stuck. I'm not a fan of that. And if pawn moves, well, if pawn moves here or here, bishop can cover both. So I'm liking this. We'll do this. All right, so pawn takes that. Is there any problem with bishop taking this? I don't think so. I mean, that pins this piece. That pins this piece. So I like that. Wait, I move here. What if he brings his pawn down? Then what? I can't take. I mean, I could take with the knight. And then they take with a pawn. I take with a bishop. They take with a knight. I'm down. I'm, I, I lose more material than he does. So that's not good. So if I were him, my move might be to bring this pawn down. Is there another? Do we have something else? Is it, well, there's nothing else that can take this piece. So actually, I, I feel like I need to do this, even if I move back afterwards. Oh, we brought the queen. That's a, a curious tactic. Um, I see no reason not to take the queen. All right, king moves one. Now, I don't want to start a new timeline because I don't really have a reason to yet. Oh, upside down mouse point. I didn't even realize that. Oh, yeah, because it's it's flipped. I had to flip it. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Um, okay, so. Oh, yeah. The, oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, you're not even seeing. So, okay, that that can I fix this? Is there a way to fix this? there okay that's that should be better right so king moves here but yeah I don't, I don't want to I don't need to create a new timeline yet so I don't I'm not going to um, all right this pawn here ooh ooh 
wait a second, this pawn up here creates a lot of problems for him. Yeah, this, what's, all right, what's the problems with me doing this? I mean, he's gonna take the pawn, but now he's, he's really exposing his king. I bring the queen out, he, he has to move back or block it with the knight. He could block it with the knight, but that would be a dumb move. He, he would probably move the king back, and then if I could protect it, I could take the bishop and it's game over. Yeah, I'm liking that, I'm liking that, that's bold. That's bold, that's a bold move. What? Oh, he did on, I didn't even realize one could do that. He did en passant. I think that's what that's called. Okay, I take with this, he takes with pawn. Hello, monkey. Wait a second, a new opponent has interrupted the tournament. Do I take this? And I think I will. Let's bet the moves, and we'll probably go back and forth. Okay, so he's created a new timeline. That's a bold choice on your part, sir. Wait, which, which way is better? If I go here or if I go here? Move it left. I think you're right. I think you are correct. Oh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. See, had I moved it here, he couldn't have done that. He would have had to bring the knight out. But now we can... Oh, wait. If I move here, I think I got it. Right? This is... This is... Is that checkmate? Is this checkmate, though? I think this is checkmate. He can't take the queen. He can't get out of the way of the queen. He can't move here. That'll put him in check. He has nothing to block it because I'm right up against him. He can't do anything with the timeline. I think this is checkmate. Yep, that's checkmate. Yeah, I've 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 checked I've checked him in three different ways. So whenever you are ready, we shall do this. Again, my chess is not great. Okay. Looks like you are going first. Uh, yeah, I'll match. Again, I am not great at chess. Okay, so knight hops over here. Okay, so you got three knights on the board. We'll submit the move, and we'll wait on this one. I don't see any reason to make a move there yet. So I want my pawns a little bit more protected. So we'll go, we'll be a little bit more conservative there. If you can get a clear line to the king from your queen and you can get her to stay there, she will eventually be able to check checkmate the king in the past. All right, so we got a check here. Oh, yes, he's checking me in the past. So me blocking here does not solve the problem because the queen can come back in the past. Even if this king moves... Is this, is this checkmate? Have I lost? I haven't lost. It would tell me if I lost. Oh, so if I go back in time, I could move here. And that pushes, that will push the past all the way back. So this pushes the present back. So now, if we ever get to this board, I lose. Because I can't, I can't move my king in the past, and the queen has a direct line of sight to my king. Uh, what did you do? Yeah, you took you took the uh, queen. That makes total sense. Let's move there. Submit the move. We got a ticking time bomb here. I've got one, two. I've got two more moves before we get back to that bad place. Okay. Why would that not be? A, why would that not be good? How close are we to my demise? So this next turn, I have to pull this piece back somehow. Okay, blocks with the bishop. So now, okay, so now I have to play all the boards on the present, and if I play this board, I'm done. Yeah. So I need to go back in time one more time. Uh, okay, where can we go? Oh, I can't go anywhere there. Oh, this is bad news bears. This is bad news bears. Oh, I think, I think I may. Uh, I just don't, I don't have the pieces. Nothing is developed here. I'd love to go back here, but I just waste a queen, and he can still do the same song and dance he did before. We have to have something developed here, and here at least I have two queens. 
Knight to c6. Are you telling me actual things or are you just saying things? I mean, I I can do that. I don't know that it's going to help. <laughs> okay, just saying things. Good. All right, we're going to bring this. We're going to we have to bring this queen back. That's that's all we can do. Um, and bringing this queen here, I, I can't go this far back because I just lose a queen. So we're going to go queen here and hope this works. Yeah, no, it's not going to be enough. It's not going to be enough. So I have no more timelines. Like, I mean, I can make new timelines, but it's not going to, he doesn't have to play them. So he has to play this, but now he's ahead one on timelines. And I have to, I have to get basically check in one. So this is a check in one scenario, and I don't think that's possible. Um, oh, no, 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 I still have, no, I still, I, no, this, this would be it. What if I go here? If I go here, he would just take that, right? I don't get rid of that queen. Can I get rid of that? Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Move the queen here. Move the queen here. Submit moves. I've seen Back to the Future, Back to the Future several times, so I suggest you go back in time and empower your king to stand up to the high school bully. Okay, he, he moves the queen here, but confuse him with randomness and sacrifice. Big, big brain time. Yes, but my big brain time tells me I can take the piece that was going to take me in the past. Aha! I've survived another round. Ooh. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Oh, I survived that. Oh, I survived that. I'm in probably a terrible position, but I'm still technically alive. Thank you, monkey. <laughs> still technically alive. Okay, wait. How? What can she do here? If she moves here, it's not a bad move. That's not a bad move at all. Because you're actually pretty weak on this board as well. I'm liking this move. I'm liking this move a lot. Because I can decimate these pieces. Yeah, we'll do that. Because I can always bring her back if I need to. And then what are we looking at here? Um, two queens. I'm not a fan of that. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. I don't like it, but I don't see anything much better. All right, submit. It won't matter. Probably not. There's that spring guy. I heard a monkey could beat him. <laughs> All right, what did you do? What do we have here? Yeah, without me having to go through two timelines, like that really hurt me. That really gave me a kick in the teeth. Because I, there's nothing I can do. I can't make any new timelines. And if he gets in trouble, he can always make new timelines. Bottom two boards are both going to checkmate. All right, hold on. Let me look. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can spot it. You attack probably a king sometime in the past here. Was my king ever there? Well, my king was never there. Okay, my king was never here. So you coming all the way down here isn't going to do anything. You'd have to go here, right? Because then you're attacking uh, one of these kings somewhere. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh, I'm a dum-dum. Oh, I'm a dum-dum. I'm a dummy dum-dum. I didn't even think about that. Ah, well. I sort of I sort of took the moral victory when I didn't die on that that one uh, that one stage. Let's see. Uh, might as well just castle here. Get that get that out of the way. Really box myself in here. That was not my best. But yeah, I just haven't been able to get my queens up to do the damage. Um, I I don't think I was aggressive enough. What else can we do here? Uh, that's you know what that solves all my problems. There we are. Submit the moves. All right, so you're doing your, your bare minimum to stop. Oh, how right, of course. The thing you did before, Spring, he, he, monkey pulled this trick on you five turns ago. Why do you not learn anything? <laughs> God, Spring, you're a moron. Okay. Yeah, this is bad. This is no good. But yes, very well played. Finish the game. Yes, well, definitely well played. Yeah. Um, like I said, I, I I am taking I'm taking a very slight moral victory for getting myself out of the predicament I put myself in, and then I lose that victory when you pulled the same trick on me again. <laughs> God, I'm a moron.